Another school here, Salt Lake Community College, is seeing a 10% increase in new applications for the fall semester. Wow. New at 4, Fox 13's Sydney Glenn shows us how the uncertainty surrounding COVID-19 could be playing a role. Once the pandemic hit, it was like a big transition. To Izzy Baker, like online. many of us, had no idea how to navigate the pandemic, including what school would be like. My father lost his job, but then he got a new one. But it was that uncertainty, like, how am I going to pay for school? Um, am I even going to do good uh, while going online? She says she's happy she was at Salt Lake Community College. Especially since uh, a lot of the university students having to move back and telling their experiences there, how it was really difficult uh, fully transitioning online. Community colleges across the nation have seen a decline in enrollment in the past few years. The pandemic uh, roiled community colleges across the country and Salt Lake Community College was no exception. Curtis Larson says they're seeing a glimmer of hope this fall as Salt Lake Community College College has seen a 10% increase in applications. There's this value proposition that community college just makes sense. The average in-state student here in Utah will save about $10,000 by starting at community college compared to a four-year university, Larson said. Gabriel Moreno is one of those people. If someone like me can do it, someone who's an immigrant, someone whose first language is not English, someone who did not know how to navigate the higher education system can do it, I think anyone can do it. Baker's plans aren't stopping here, but she is thankful during these uncertain times, she is paying less for her education. Going to uh, save up by getting another job. Um, I do want to get my bachelor's degree um, in graphic design. Larson says during the pandemic, they really learned how to make education more accessible than ever before. He hopes that will continue on and in turn, that will continue to encourage people to start their college career here. In Taylorsville, Sydney Glenn, Fox 13 News, Utah.